Hey, what's up guys? So I thought I'd make a quick uh, video here of my team RXP uh, Ultimate Dual Catch Can System on a uh, 2022 uh, Tahoe with a 5.3 liter, uh, liter V8 engine. So <clears throat> didn't really have like great options on how and where to mount this thing, but I've had a uh, Team RXP Catch Can products in the past and i'm not sure if you can see it but there's an amber orange color looking hardware up here kind of where my shadow is pointing uh lift my finger up about right above my finger right there you can see the uh the bracket it's kind of a straight bracket that's at a diagonal with some slots on it it turned out to be a decent method of uh mounting this thing and then so you can see that screw that just appeared right there that's where it's bolted down to uh, back there. I believe that's part of the air conditioning system on the truck. But he used that bolt, uh, picked up a flange nut from Lowe's and a little bit of Teflon tape uh, in order to get that on there. Now it's a half inch socket is what you'll need. Put a little Teflon tape on there, no washers uh, because the threads poke through just a little bit. Uh, so that was one possible spot. The other possible spot you can kind of see as a point with my finger right there uh, on the back, but that's a smaller nut. It didn't seem just as sturdy, but it's gonna be a lot more difficult to get the, uh, the catch can mounted up there with that bracket piece. I'm gonna try to zoom in on, ow. get back there in the bracket for you. You can kind of see it. Uh, back in behind there with that black part back right back there is that bracket piece that i'd use and kind of see the gap there just a little bit on the screen as far as the little slots where you can mount the back of the uh the catch cam out so uh talked to james from team rxp and uh we got this thing set up because it is a little bit different i don't have a stock intake anymore i have a air raid junior intake with the uh drop-in filter using the stock air box with the air raid junior intake but this is pretty much how this thing should work is you got your pc valve uh right here and this is going to come out follow my finger and goes up to the top of the middle of the can uh back up there uh, now on the side of the can coming out the side, I've got my one-way check valve. It comes all the way back here. I'm back into the manifold way back there. And then on the other side over here on the is another one-way check valve. And this is going to come into a T-fitting, which I'll talk about that here in a second. So on some of the other videos uh, for the Chevys, uh, it says to drill a hole in the stock air box and this line right here will go into that uh, That new hole Well talking to James at team RXP. He said this would work. So what I did here is coming off of the passenger side uh, Valve cover down here. You can see coming here follow this line and it comes up to the middle of the mini can and then off the side of the mini cam, which I threw a little uh, clamp on there because it seemed like it was going to go on real easy. I used a little bit of a WD-40 to help get all these hoses on, but this wanted to go on there real easy. So I put a little clamp on there to try to help that out, make sure it doesn't come off. So again, passenger side manifold here comes around to the top of the mini can from the mini can this line coming down over here and this side is going to go into your intake but talking to james at team rxp uh he suggested that we, you put a t in right here and then off the side of the can where you've got this one-way check valve is going to go into the top of the t uh and that was it so it took me a while to try to help figure out exactly how and where i was going to mount this catch can but uh, again, back there, that, that seems to be working. I'll just kind of monitor the threads on that. I'm moving it pretty good. I'm not really cranking on it hard, but you can see it does move around there just a li little bit. Um, it is kind of close to the exhaust headers down there. So uh, the drains 
So I basically ran the drain line straight down and then basically between the frame and the wheel well, there's a little hole way, way down, way down here where my fingertip is pointing way down there and then over the side to the side. At about uh, three feet of line, that was plenty long enough. Uh, we're just gonna see how that works for now. So I've watched a couple other videos on catch cans uh, to get this install done. There's an option over here for another brand. Uh, that's not really workable when you're using the a cans that are together like that. Maybe if the mount came straight down and then a can on each side. There's really not too many options on these. Uh, it seems like on this Tahoe because the stock air intake is so huge over here. It just takes up a lot of room. Uh, so we're gonna see how this works out. I will say, going back to the videos, the other videos that I watched, uh, there's another one by another uh, YouTuber, Lone Star Hawaiian, who has on a Silverado. He had some loud noise, I think is coming from the PC, PC, PCV valve side, uh, but it sounds like it got a lot of air rushing uh, coming from the, uh, into the manifold side back here. I double checked, make sure Made sure it was connected on there real good. It looks like it's connected down real good. Also, while the engine was running from cold, not already hot like it is now. With it running, put my hand down here. I'm not feeling any air or anything like that. Uh, but you can just kind of hear the air washing sounds. Not like a whistle, but like air running through real fast with a straw. It did take my truck around, tile around the block for a spin and kind of got on it. Um, pedal to the floor I got a couple spots for a second or two and no issues everything seems to be running so uh we'll go from there I did contact James about that one but I haven't heard her back from him but um it sounds like it it could be a known issue on these uh 5.3 so anyways that wraps up the uh team RXB uh ultimate catch can system the tw twin can on a 2022 uh, Chevrolet Tahoe Z71 5.3 liter. See you guys.